There were several location shoots for this film, the Kansas Cosmosphere in Hutchinson. Um, I always, since I moved here, I always, you know, I, I first went there and I always thought, wow, I'd love to shoot part, a scene for a film here. And then they had the total remodeling and added that whole section of the new lobby with the SR-71 in there and all the planes. Uh, we went and shot that on a Saturday morning. It was actually Valentine's Day. <laughs> that Saturday morning we went and shot and because uh, we went when it first opened, so we weren't interfering with a lot of people. Actually, if you really look at the scene, it's shot pretty much in order chronologically. So those first shots, you barely see anybody there. And by the final shot, there's a crowd of people. <laughs> For the actual dialogue scene, I had Brian wearing a wireless mic. And I actually had the camera kind of far away so that someone may not realize that those two people talking were actors. You know, they were just standing there talking and I'm shooting there filming for whatever reason. And, and I didn't have any lights set up. I used just the available lighting coming in from those huge windows. And it was just different filming in a place where there was people walking around and it was more like a more of a realistic filming than as far as shooting at the college when there's a closed, it's more of a closed set at the college. As far as going to the Cosmosphere, there's people walking around. It's more of a real life setting. I kind of enjoyed that. The big uh, on location shoot that I kind of had was the scene in Kansas City at the Pembroke Hill School. I went to the Pembroke Hill School. That's one of the reasons why I shot. The f there were two main reasons why I went and shot this scene at the Pembroke Hill School and why my, ha my character had to be an art teacher there. Uh, the first reason is that uh, my father is head of the art department there. So that's his art room you know, that you see in the film. The other reason was that um, the, the school is planning to do extensive remodeling and new construction at the campus. Next year they're starting the remodeling and uh, that upper deck that I walk across when you first see me come in, that's the upper school complex. They're going to take off all that, that whole upper deck so you can walk up there and remodel the outside of it and then Ashley Hall, that older building that I then cross and walk down in front of and the three girls walk by. Ashley Hall is going to be completely torn down and a new building built there. You know, I wanted to preserve uh, the school and I guess my memories of the school. The other actor who was in the scene with me, Johnny Johns, he's, he and I went to school at Pem Day. Uh, we've known each other since second grade. Whenever I can, if we're shooting a scene in Kansas City, I always call him up, hey, come on, you know, let's, let's do another film, let's do a scene for the film. And we did it again this year. And one, one kind of funny note about that, that day of shooting, we shot that in the fall of 1997, that scene at, at the Pembroke Hill School, in the art room there. Uh, Ten years earlier, in 1987, we shot a film called The Honey Thief which was my first film that I made that I entered into a film festival and I actually won like a second place award with it. And it was a comedy and there was a scene that took place in that art room, that very same art room, the two of us together. So I thought that was kind of a, a fun thing to go back and watch that scene that we shot in 1987 and maybe compare it to how much we've changed in 10 years and going back and shooting in that same room.